Cityscape Sky Bar is now opening up at the Union Square Hilton. Amanda Harry has that story. The Cityscape Bar is back in business. Located within the Union Square Hilton Hotel, it shut down for renovations and rebranding. But Director of Marketing the Hotel, Nick Graham Wells, says the bar survived the pandemic, so he knew it would survive this. We always have bounced back. We've always been able to grow back into things. We've always been able to rebound. When Rob Webb heard about the reopening, he knew he had to come back with his girlfriend. We met here like a year ago, so um, we're coming back for like a, a year anniversary. So it's uh, incredible. The bar is the tallest in the city, located on the 46th floor of the hotel and has a 360 degree view. There's no other place in San Francisco that has this perspective. It's amazing. While this bar highlights recovery and rebuilding, it's not far from areas of Union Square where there has been trouble. Just down the street, which you can see from the windows of the bar, is the area where wide receiver Ricky Pearsall was shot just two weeks ago. But Graham Wells says he still thinks the future is bright for Union Square. He doesn't buy into the doom loop theory that says San Francisco is in a cycle of economic decline. I think it's been grossly exaggerated. According to Placer.ai, a company that analyzes foot traffic based on cell phone data, in the Union Square area, foot traffic is down 3% between July of 2024 and July of 2023. It's still down 16% compared to pre-COVID times. I kind of see that. It's a worry, isn't it? James Malcolm is from London, but visits San Francisco frequently for work. He says he's noticed the change. I've always loved coming to San Francisco, and it, you know, it feels like it's gone downhill a bit. In Union Square, foot traffic was slow for a Saturday, but police presence was apparent. Mayor London Breed and police said they would be upping staffing in the area ahead of the holidays and after the Pearsall shooting. Graham Wells says he looks at all the people who have continued to work for Cityscape and the Hilton over the years, and he feels strongly that San Francisco will recover. We've got one of the most tenured teams in the city, 30, 40 years from over 100 team members. And I think if, if the doom loop were truly true, why would you stick around for 40 years? He believes that one day the economic recovery will surpass pre-pandemic. And this bar is one step in that direction.